Ladies and gentlemen, this is a live look from the Hilton San Diego Bayfront Hotel camera. That is Petco Park. We're in a little under four hours from now. We will be taking on those San Francisco Giants in our home opener. Yeah. Oh, but you know that song, ladies and gentlemen, that we're playing for you right now. The mighty, mighty Aztecs are playing in the Sweet 16 yes, today. Yes. Let's go! And go Aztecs. several spots around town are having viewing parties in here to tell us. I mean, you know these folks. They are the <laughs> biggest state fans we know. Carlos and Esmeralda, welcome. Good well, morning to you both. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, should you be in front of me, Carlos, or behind me with the yeah, feathers? Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> I have to deal with this all the time myself. Yes. <laughs> She's like, we're having fun, though. That's the most important Absolutely. part. We're super excited. Excited for tonight's game as well against UConn, yes. 439. Yes. Well, where can we watch? Well, well, let's start with that. Well, where you might watch it from your home, but there's going to be great places. San Diego State Via House Arena is going to be a great place. That's where we're going to be. Oh, cool. And then we're going to Nobu Brewing in Mission oh. Valley. And then we're going to hit Ailsmith. Huge Aztec fans so you're there. You're kind of bouncing oh, around yeah. during the game. Oh. Well, we're promoting the love of San Diego State. It's like a tour. It is. <laughs> so we are making a tour, honestly, and we want to promote the love of the Aztecs, San Diego State, and the community of San Diego. Hey, they can watch the Padre game, go to it, and then go home or go to any of these venues. Yeah. And then we're going to go up to OG's up in Carmel Mountain. Ooh, the huge venue. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, it's a lot of great so, places. So you saw that information. We put it up. It's at Nova Mission Valley first, then Alesmith Brewing in Miramar, OG's in Carmel Mountain Ranch. There's never been a better time to be able to do a tour like that because you can watch the game on your phone. Exactly. While somebody else is driving. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Carlos, <laughs> talk to me. You went to the championship game last year. I want you to tell me about that environment, what that game was like. And now we got to take on these knuckleheads again in the sweep. I don't like that they put us on the same region, by the way. But whatever. That's well, a whole hey, other you know what? Underdogs, we love to be the underdogs. Yeah, yeah. And this team is amazing, like last year. Yeah. And going there to Houston was incredible. I took the whole family. We had such a blast. I mean, Houston was very inviting. But we had more fans than I'd ever yeah. seen ever anywhere. I mean, 75,000 fans, I believe, in that arena. Mm -hmm. And uh, my wife and daughter, Bella, she'd never seen it perform until <laughs> there. Cool. And it was crazy. So uh, a lot of fun. San Diego is getting behind the teams with the Padres tonight, and then also San Diego State. Super excited. You you must have had Husky fans taking pictures with oh, you. Oh, yeah, I mean, it was insane. Now. I, mean, right? I probably had about 50% were all Husky Ooh, fans. Yeah. That's <laughs> I remember the Mountain West just uh, last week when they were playing the championship. Uh -huh. I mean, right. all the other teams wanted to picture with the of Aztec course. Warriors. Yeah, of course. Why and now not? the Warrior S, we have Esmeralda playing the Warrior. Yes. So we're bringing the female side I to the that. Aztec Warrior. Okay, so tonight, I, you, like you said, underdogs, however, yes. the Aztecs chances when Oh yeah, I, want to hear it. I, I think hear it. they're. I think you know. I like to say 50-50, but hey, I'm going to give them the odds because they are the underdogs, and yeah. as long as they come out with that mindset to win and lay it all out on the mm -hmm. court, that's the most important part. And last year's championship game, Jaden Ladee was not Jaden Ladee. Mm -hmm. This kid's nope. a yeah. Beast. Oh yeah. And, and if he shows up and we get another 13 3 pointer oh, yeah. well, you never know. And you know what? I think then the rest of the bench will step up right. as long as they come together right. to play together. Most important part about San Diego State winning. Speaking about the most important part, tell me about the Aztec Warrior Foundation, what you guys do mm -hmm. and kind of what the goal is. So the Aztec Warrior Foundation is to bring back the spirit of an Aztec warrior to the university. We did this in 2002 mm -hmm. when uh, Dr. Weber had taken away the Monty Montezuma. We created the Aztec mm -hmm. Warrior, the foundation, nonprofit, 501c3. You can see we have all our gear. Nice. And Hi. then we have, you know, support the Aztec <laughs> Warrior. You can go to AztecWarriorFoundation.com. Uh, and on Instagram and uh, all our social medias, we all have a gear. We've got a lot of sponsors step up to support, bringing back not only the spirit of the Aztec warrior, because we're all warriors inside of us, we're fighting against something always. So that's kind of the idea behind it, besides bringing a student. So we want to give a full scholarship so anyone out there that ah. may want to play the role, I'd like to retire, please. <laughs> so and bring back to a student. So if you no, know a student don't. that think that they would do it, I'll come back alumni. <laughs> Nevertheless, I'll train them, coach them, and we're raising a lot of money for that. So if anybody nice. would like to donate towards this cause, 5123 uh -huh. nonprofit. Go to AztecWarrior.com and uh, check us out. Phantom on Zoom is another one. And real quick, because we have Esmeralda here, you said Warrior, is it Warrior S? Warrior S. Warrior. Yes, Warrior talk S. to me a little bit about that. Well, it's, <laughs> She's a, like, well. it's a new thing that I really resonated with, especially because I have been to Mexico and I have seen what indigenous people now and today are living like and mm. it just resonates to be a part of something that is deeper than just me. Mm. Like we come from 
somewhere where we have this as our culture and yeah. I think it's a beautiful thing mm -hmm. that we do need to do our part to represent effectively. And if you go to Mexico City, you see this everywhere. Yeah. And all throughout yeah. Mexico, they, I mean, they have the women culture. Yes. 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 And that's yes. kind of the message that you're, that's and then you hope to do that with young girls as well. Yes. Exactly. Yes. And what's wrong with having a human represent that? That's yes. what we would yeah. like to ask the president and she won't talk to us unfortunately, but we're still going to be pressing because the community of San Diego, everybody that's around San Diego State and around the Aztecs love the image, they love the idea, they love the culture, so why not be able to put it out there into the eyes of everybody and the kids too. Mm -hmm. All right, Carlos, Esmeralda, we thank you both. Yeah. Yes. Listen, man, go do your yeah, thing. You I'll say go Aztecs! Go. Thank you, Fox 5, go San Diego Padres, and go Aztecs win, baby! Woo.